Now the fun part begins. So first, make sure you have all of your pieces. You have a wooden game board frame. So that is this piece here. You have your game board base. You have your game board stand. You have a bumper, a backboard, which is right here. You have game tiles, sticky foam feet, side pieces, launcher pieces, large braces and smaller braces, orange spacers, washers, bolts, rubber bands, double stick foam rectangles, sticky foam curves, stickers, or of course design, catapult balls, which I did leave in the back so I didn't lose any yet, uh, a dry erase marker, and our scorecard. And we are ready to get started putting this together. So I'm gonna open up our blueprints. Step one, prepare the bumper by folding the tabs along the score lines. So we're gonna take this bumper piece here and a score line is basically that already made indentation. So it's as if they're saying, hey guys, fold at this line right here. So just fold it back. So all you have to do is crease and then uncrease the tabs for crisp edges. You want this to be as smooth as possible. Just fold where it's already indicating to. Then you're gonna insert the tabs into the bottom slots along the bottom of the wooden frame. So I have my wooden frame here and I'm going to stick it into the slots provided. and it's naturally going to curve. Now it's okay if it's falling out a little bit. We're going to we're going to fix that. No worries. This is all about having fun and building something with our own hands. Now step two, we fold those tabs back over. Look at that, it looks like vampire fangs. Fold those tabs back over so they lay flat on the wood and you use the yellow circle stickers. So you take out just the yellow part, see right in the middle, the yellow circle stickers to hold them in place. You're gonna use that like tape. There's four of them. So I'm gonna do my corners first. Here you can see where we're at using them as tape. Then I'm gonna do the two ends here right around that circle piece. And I'll show you what I have. All right finished with step two. Now if you need to, don't be afraid to pause the video and get to this point and then you can press play as we continue on. Also guys, make sure that the stickers do not go over this hole here. It's very important that this hole stays untouched by the stickers. Don't cover it up. Now what we're gonna do is take this piece and flip it over. 